I push her down, I'm gonna I'm coming for this, right? If it's a uh, sexual assault, you don't want to you don't want to wait till a guy gets on top of you to start doing stuff. Okay, you want to keep them off you. So you're gonna you have your hands up now. What are you gonna do? Your legs, right? You keep your legs up. Yeah. Now, what's very important is um, when you kick because there's important parts. Of it. I'm gonna show you the anatomy. So when you kick, uh, put your extended toes in. Now, this line. Um, this is a straight line with the, with the pull up to the heel. Basically taking a pole and ramming it in somebody, okay? So this is fixed right now, right there. Okay? So, and the one thing you do too is you wanna to pull the toes back. If you don't do this, this happens. When you try to kick somebody, you'll break your toes. So, you pull the toes back. Um, and then also what you don't wanna do, that's sort of, um, the, the, if you look at the anatomy of the foot, there's this, this bone that goes on the side. It's very easy to break that. Um, so, you see in like karate magazines, it will go like these kind of, like, you know, like this with the knife edge part of your foot. Um, it's nice for magazine covers and stuff, but you know, they do like this, right? But you're gonna, that's a very easy bone to break, okay? What you don't want to do is kick somebody and then you break the foot. So it's very important. So you're gonna kick with the ball of your foot and the heels and that's it, okay? Um, so now what you're gonna do, you can also use your hands to, to pivot around. So, just like we did chaotic with the with the striking, you do the same thing with the legs. It's going to be kind of chaotic. You just want to kind of keep me at bay. Now, at this point, um, you want to keep the kicks either to my knees, join uh, at the most. You're not going to go for a headshot yet because I'm too high, right? So, and if you're a lot shorter, right? So, you if I come in, you're just going to try to kick me. What I'm going to do, I'm going to try to get through that defense because that's what I want, right? Now, you don't have to stay fixed in that one spot. So, so I'm gonna try to move you around. Okay, if you go this way, so here, I'm gonna try to come to the side. So she, no, it's a good, see how she's moving around? This is not a lay still and just put your legs out. Um, I'm just gonna try to get more of a tactical advantage on her. Okay. This will actually take good core strength, right? Cause you gotta pivot, you're kicking. You can use your, your elbows to pivot, so here, Really, like this kick, right, and like this. But I'm always putting my hands up in guard. But I can go like this to kind of help give me leverage, turning your hips. And you want to keep them fast and coming, because what happens if you leave your foot out? You gotta do it slow, and you can leave it. If I, I can just grab this foot and then whatever, like this, and pin. You don't want to leave it out there. I'll grab it. I can actually go like this, and then let's go somewhere, right? And then, right? So. This is going to be kind of a chaotic, I'm going to tell you how to kick. I'm going to come this straight up when the park strip fall. I'm going to do a very light push, push her to ground and I'm coming in. Okay, park strip fall. Go, I'm coming in, don't let it come. Bang, don't let me come in, kick, 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 come on. Kick, 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 kick. Get those knees up. Now, one thing you can also do, uh, stand up. Now, if you notice, I started closing the gap on her. Come we'll closer. When she was kicking, I kind of got to the side. You can always, because I, you're not gonna be able to kick because you your foot all the way back to the chamber, right? But I can just bring my leg up here as a, as a shield, and here and then, right? So let's try that. Yeah. Come on. Kick, kick, kick. Good job, good job.